Is it me, or did it just get drafty in here? What a mess. Who else got away? Mm, I'm getting other supervillain sense here. Mandarin, Red Skull, and Loki. Where's Thor? In Asgard. He needs to know about this. Apple pie. We've got to save America from the Red Skull. Hulk smash skull! Huh? Hulk rip pants. That's why my red, white, and blue uniform is form-fitting, yet flexible. I love American ingenuity. I have some tracking to do. I'll keep in touch. Or not. Tony. Let's get you back to Stark Tower and into something, uh, less revealing. Oh, I have a great new outfit I put together the other day. Stark Tower dominates the Manhattan skyline as either a highly advanced technological research facility or a giant monument to its owner's ego. Depends who you ask. Did I ever tell you about my party armor? It was designed like a tuxedo, for more formal battles. Honey, I'm home! What's with the hostile welcome? Jarvis, it's me. Your boss man? Intruder alert. Security activated. Intruders? Jarvis, Security Override Command Tango, Oscar Sierra 3963. We're gonna have to fight our way in. Someone must have hacked my systems. It's the kind of thing I do to other people. What the? Arc reactor storage access granted. Loki, stand down! My insincerest apologies, but I need a source of high power at low cost. Well, you are stealing from the best. That's not the only thing we've stolen. Where are you going? Never trust a demigod.
So, like my suit? I have a soft spot for the oldies. Oh, oh. Why is it my tower can never stay in one piece? We're in danger. The big bad end of the world kind of danger. Initial tests by Reed Richards show that these bricks store the power cosmic and are the remains of the silver surface board. If that means what I think it means, you alone have the expertise we need to help defend the Earth. It looks like both our labs have been trashed. These bad guys love to steal our stuff. And they've been stealing far too much of it. We need to move on our Latveria operation. I call it Operation Latveria. I'll call the rest of the Fantastic Four. Right. Turn on S.H.I.E.L.D.'s arc reactor tracking software. Tracking my arc reactor signatures? Do you know how many times I've had to find you at some crazy party? You see, having the best intelligence gives you the upper hand. Hawkeye, Black Widow, you're up. Standing over 1,400 feet tall and weighing 365,000 tons, the Empire State Building was opened in 1931 and has remained one of New York City's most recognizable landmarks ever since. Looks like Wolverine beat us here. The signal's gotten stronger, so follow it, agents. This could be a problem. Hey, you guys need any help? are stable. Excellent. Red Skull, I'm gonna spangle you till you see stars. Still in that ridiculous outfit. You need a bigger wardrobe budget. You cannot defeat me. Picked up the Skull's trail outside the raft. He wears a stinky cologne. We appreciate the help, but you've destroyed the Vortex. Now we can't follow Loki. Yeah, well, I get the sense that Loki isn't just a hired hand in this thing. They'll be fine, Director Fury. They may not be super, but they are heroes. Colonel Fury, sir. Loki jumped into a vortex and vanished. I know someone that can help locate him. Most of what S.H.I.E.L.D. knows about Thor and his people remains highly classified. What little information we've obtained about his home, Asgard, comes from, well, this one children's book found by Dr. Eric Selvig in New Mexico. Seems pretty accurate so far. Get a load of this guy. Ooh, very theatrical with the lightning and everything. He is the God of Thunder. It's sort of his thing. I sense the opening of the Vortex because Brother Loki used it as a pathway to Asgard. What the heck's he after? He is ever after only one thing. Power. And also helmets with horns. He's ah. really into those. <laughs> Thank you. 
The Tesseract is dangerous, brother. Oh, and so am I, brother. I intend to get my revenge on you, on Earth, and on Asgard. What are you planning, Loki? You can't make me tell. You are not the god of me. Oh, thou dost vex me with that taunt. You have used it since we were children. Do you remember this little plaything? I will return the Tesseract to the safekeeping of the treasure room. Hey, Blondia, I hate to point this out, but it just got stolen from there. Maybe your security's not so good. S.H.I.E.L.D. has an entire battalion of troops dedicated to guarding the Tesseract. Humans, guarding this item of immense power. Please, I can rain thunder and lightning on anyone who touches it. I bet this glow cube can help me find Magneto. I can ask Chuck about that. The final pieces are coming together. Soon you will rule the Earth. Yes, yes. But where is the power source you promised me? It's all we need. I know where it is. We can acquire it from the mutants. The X-Men? Very well. I've planned for every contingency. I'll dispatch some associates to reacquire it. Brought you something, Professor. Figure this can help us find Magneto. The only thing I think it will find for us is unwanted attention. Oh dear. Oh, that doesn't sound good. And that doesn't look good. Officially, Professor Charles Xavier's Institute for Higher Learning is an ordinary boarding school. But the truth is, it also serves as a home and shelter for young mutants with extraordinary powers, collectively known as the X-Men. Come on, we need to rescue the students. Professor. Professor X has agreed to let me care for the Tesseract. He has. Of course. He knows I'm good with technology. And he knows you'll double-cross him at the drop of your helmet. <laughs> well, that's no way to treat a lady, Summers. Make sure the children are protected. I'll take care of these two. No running in the hallway, please. Oh! How many times must I say it? No running in the hallways! Oh. Beautiful, isn't it? We 
seem to have upset the natives. Deal with them. Oh, my stars and garters. What does that even mean? Magneto got away. That is most unfortunate. I think that means we'll owe Nick Fury a few favors. <laughs> Thanks for sending Agent Coulson to help with the cleanup here. You were assisting S.H.I.E.L.D. at the time. Besides, I can expense it. But there's something else I need you Sorry, surfer dude. But you're headed for a wipeout. Iron Man. I'm reading an incoming ship. Watch out! It's about to open fire! Tony, are you all right? Ow, ow, and more ow. <sighs> With these cosmic bricks, the world will be mine to rule. But first, I should probably prevent it from being destroyed. This would have been much easier had you captured the board intact rather than blasting it to pieces. The Avengers showed up. They know how to ruin every good evil plan. Your plan is still fantastic. A poor choice of words, God of Mischief. I prefer to think of it as spectacular, maybe stupendous. I've hired every villain, bad guy, and dark minion I could find. To help assemble Dr. Doom's Doom Ray of Doom. Sort of a mouthful, but all right. Speaking of that. Silence! Now we must track down more of these cosmic bricks to build my weapon. As you command, oh most doomful one. Bigwigs go! Would you bring me some of those uh, cosmic bricks? Why didn't they make me the supervisor here? That guy's got sand for brains. Holding Grand Central hostage at rush hour? Now that's criminal. Hulk, you have to remember to look before you leap. I know, bad guys. The S.H.I.E.L.D. folks think we need to formulate a careful plan of attack using... Or we just smash our way in. Good plan. for taking the subway down to the bugle. Guess I'll just have to fight my way through it. Whoa! <clears throat> Thanks for swinging by, Spider-Man. You Avenger guys are really great at making a mess. Hey, I just replaced that.
Secure that cosmic brick, Coulson. And make sure it gets to the Fantastic Four's lab for analysis. Yes, sir. Uh, Hulk, can you help with some of this debris? <laughs> You're calling them cosmic bricks? They came from the sky, sir, for you encountered. I've given Reed Richards the job of finding out why everyone seems to want them. Thanks for your help, Spider-Man. There's always a place in this operation for a hero like you. Like I have time for that. I've got a trigonometry exam tomorrow, and my aunt needs me to pick up a dozen eggs, and I'm drowning in angst. So, who's behind all this? What exactly are they up to? And will it cut into my hot tub time? I don't know. I wish I knew, and yes. Tony, get back to Stark Tower and try to get me some answers. <sighs> <laughs> This is what I've been reduced to, relying on such pitiful mortal creatures for my plans. Though he does have a cool throne and a metal face. Director Fury, Reed Richards is here. Uh, ah, Mr. Fantastic himself. Any breakthroughs on that cosmic brick I sent you? Actually, I could use some help. Is Tony Stark around? He's working on something else. I have another Avenger here. I'm actually the first Avenger, sir. Do you have much experience with theoretical quantum mechanics and exotic nano-derived power sources? Uh, I got an A-plus in American history. Director Fury, we have confirmation that more of those bricks hit the open ocean. Hill, get me a shield research sub to gather those cosmic bricks. I want some answers. Cap, you head to the Baxter building with Reed Richards and help out the best you can. I can always sell some war bonds. Hill, another important thing. Lunch. Order in some shawarma. Stark knows the spot. The top five floors of the Baxter Building are home to the Fantastic Four. Up-to-date plans are unavailable, as Reed Richards is continuously reconfiguring the layout of his labs. Dr. Doom, it's Dr. Octopus. I found it. <clears throat> Parker, do your job! I want some play for bugle stories on the net thing, or inner face. Yes, sir. Net face. You understand the web, don't you? The web? Yeah, it's a job and a hobby. Doc Octopus? You're a real doctor, right? Because I have a pain right here, and it goes around there. And... Ooh, have I been over there? And... Wow. Your cheap health plan doesn't cover office visits. You could record it with your smartphone, JJ, if you could figure out how to turn it on. Hey, guys.
Give it up. Crime never pays. You'd be surprised. It covers medical and dental. Can't escape the long reach of justice, Ark. Stop being so grabby, Doc. I got it! I got it! I got it! Yes! I got it! We captured Doc Ock, but we lost the Green Goblin. Don't worry, we're tracking him. Target located. He's gone to the Oscorp building. What would Green Goblin want in a totally legitimate and entirely unsuspicious office tower like Oscorp? Let's go find out. That won't be necessary, Mr. Richards. Uh, fantastic? Uh... Dr. Richards. Uh, sir. Director Fury needs you and Cap back at the lab. We need to know more about these special bricks and what they can do. Then let's try to figure that out. We've got to. Because with great power comes great responsibility. Within the Oscorp building's high security perimeter, Norman Osborne's labs undertake secretive research into radical new chemical and genetic technologies. What took you so long? You shouldn't have. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you three don't seem to have the proper visitor passes. <laughs> Wow, getting a visitor pass around here is grueling. <laughs> Scared him off. You know, for a totally legitimate and unsuspicious office tower, this place is surprisingly disgusting. You said it. I think that's all of them. Uh, no. I see you. We always love running into you, Spider Man. Green Goblin, come on! I knew I should have packed my anti-goblin arrows. Legolas! Ha! Can you and the other Avengers track him down? I gotta do dishes, homework, explain to my girlfriend why I am always, always leaving her waiting at coffee places. I mean, my life is really hard. Tell me you got the brick. Sorry, sir. The Green Goblin got away. Uh, Colson. I know, sir. Clean up at Oscorp. Tell me you found something. 
Well, besides going through about a hundred keyboards for Hulk... I've gone through some of my space data about that Silver Surfer we encountered. He was filthy 